Dallas police are searching for a man who robbed a woman outside a Dallas nursing home. The guy had a gun, but the woman was able to fight him off. Fox 4 Lynn Cuano shows us how. Gracie Moore had just visited her 88-year-old mother Sunday night. As she was leaving the Tremont Retirement Community in North Dallas... Went to close the door, and he comes from behind and pushes it open out of my hand. A man with a gun forced his way into her car, jumping on top of her. I just started hitting at him and just screaming at the top of my lungs. Hitting his face? I was hitting his face, his arms, his chest. I was trying to push him out and push him out. Moore, who does not want her face on TV, says the man kept asking her to stop fighting back. So he kept saying, please, please don't scream anymore. Please don't do that. He was able to reach over her and grab the purse from the passenger seat, then took off running. I just started laying on the horn. Moore then drove to get help. She says inside her purse was her cell phone, wallet with about $100 in cash, and credit cards. While she is still shaken up, she is grateful her mother was not with her. I think she probably would have had a heart attack or a stroke. She thinks the man targeted the retirement center, expecting an elderly person who would not fight back. I think he was shocked. I really do. Because I think that's why he didn't do any other damage. I think he just took what he could get and, and ran. Tremont does have surveillance cameras and they are working to download the video to see if the attack was caught on tape. They are increasing security and adding more lights to that parking lot. Dallas police do not have any leads right now. In the newsroom, I'm Lynn Cuano. Steve, back Lynn, to you.